I remember sitting down with the sister. I am a bad. What did you do? I did this. I said, okay. How do you feel? I feel bad. I feel guilty. I said, good. First healthy sign. Second, did you do it again? Astaghfirullah, Sheikh. I never did that again ever in my life. Good. Mashallah. Second box. Check. Do you intend to do it again? Yeah, Sheikh. I will never do this again. I said, for the third box. Chop. Check. Did you give charity and sadaqah? Did you make dua? Did you make extra salah? Yeah, Sheikh. I've been doing this for seven years. Good. Check. Box. I told her, okay. So, what's the problem? <laughs> oh, Allah will never forgive me. I said, okay, hold on. Hold on. You speak in the name of Allah or Allah speaks in the name of Allah? I want to know. She said, no, Allah speaks in the name of Allah. I showed her two, three ayahs from the Quran. But Allah said, if you do one, two, three, four, I shall forgive you. So I'm telling her, you're accusing Allah of lying? Allah said, if you do one, two, three, I will forgive you. So I'm telling you, you're forgiven. Not because I'm granting you forgiveness, because I have belief in the word of Allah. So Allah said, if you do one, two, three, four, I will forgive you. And no questions asked. And Allah says, you can bring my word to me on the day of judgment and hold me to my own word. Like no problem, because I don't change my word. She said, oh my God. So Allah forgive me? I said, yes. You, I asked you specific questions. Did you lie in any of them? They said, no. I said, according to the ayah of the Quran that I just showed you, Allah has already forgiven you. Now, can you please move on? <laughs> but no, I said, I did something wrong. It's of the wrong. Go home and cry till the day you die. Because you are exactly following the traps of shaitan. He made you do the sin the first, and he's paralyzing you the second. What is this? Oh, but why? Our culture teaches us. How do you become a good Muslim? If you feel a lot of guilt. Oh, you are a good Muslim. You shall feel guilty 24-7. You shall feel dirt. You shall feel, you know, accused. You shall live in regret. Then you, who said that? Is your design or Allah and his message? Because Allah's message, I don't read any of this. Allah and his messenger said, if you do something good and you feel the guilt, Take that guilt and use it as a propeller, an engine to make you go and do something right and move on. Don't get stuck in guilt.